What's up everybody, it's Mark from 403 Fauna. On today's video, we're gonna take a look at a Mojave Het Monsoon crossed with a hurricane. So I hope you kick back and listen in and enjoy the video. So I wanted to start off by sharing with you this Het Pied 50% possible Het Monsoon that I produced last year. And just take a look at the pattern and why many believe that Het Monsoons are actually an incomplete dominant. You can see the, just a crazy pattern it has. It reminds me of Hurricane. And the reason I did this pairing is because I wanted to see if there's that synergistic reaction between the Het Monsoon and the Hurricane. Maybe they'll end up looking like Super Hurricanes. And as we're gonna see on this clutch, my hunch was correct. So right here, female, Het for Monsoon 50%, or I'm sorry, Het for Pied 50% possible Het Monsoon that I think will prove out to be Het for Monsoon. So let's take a look at the babies from this clutch. Here goes the first little gem. This is a hurricane, 50% possible hit for monsoon. Now my hurricane stock comes from Gray's Reptiles and he bought his directly from Hans Winner, who, the founder of the Hurricane Morph. I know Hurricane Blitz and Trick have been proven to be genetically identical, but honestly, if you look on Morph Market and compare examples of all three, Hurricane overwhelmingly comes out on top as far as best looking pattern and be sure that when you buy hurricane you do buy hans winter stock so this one's absolutely crazy if you ask me if this isn't het monsoon it's probably one of the the best hurricanes out there it's absolutely crazy look at this pattern it's got that beautiful dark coloration now you can't really tell as far as eye stripes because hurricanes themselves do have thin eye stripes, but that's a pretty darn thin eye stripe there. Check the sex on this. And we have a female, so female hurricane, 50% possible head for monsoon. Here goes another hurricane, 50% possible head monsoon. Now, if you ask me, this one is even crazier than the last. Just extreme patterning. Look at these multiple alien heads running along the dorsal. So if there's any truth to hit monsoons being incomplete dominant, this would make a case for that. This rivals some super hurricanes that I've seen. Definitely will not see a better hurricane out there, more crazy pattern than this one right here. Absolutely beautiful. That is another girl right there. So we're, we're all waiting on that monsoon test from RGI, so Rare Genetics Inc. Let's get on the ball with that one because I've got seven babies here that I'll be testing for Het Monsoon. I thought I'd share these next two together because they are both Mojave's, not Hurricane, I don't think. So let's just try to guess at Het Monsoon here. Let's take a look at this one first. So it is kind of a wacky Mojave, but with just the variability in the phenotypes, I don't want to guess whether this is Het Monsoon or not. Wouldn't be surprised if it ends up being Het Monsoon. So Mojave, 50% possible Het Monsoon. Let's take a look at the other one. Now this one, take a look at the belly here. Looks different than the other one. It kind of does look hurricane-ish here, but I don't think it's hurricane. But if you were to say, 
hey, one of these is definitely hit monsoon. I would say this one probably would be it. Super thin eye stripes. Let's compare eye stripes between these two. They both have thin eye stripes. Mojave in general do. Again, I wouldn't be surprised if they both turn out to be hit monsoon. Let's go ahead and get the gender of these two. That is also a female. I tell you what, man. I did hatch more males this year than previous years, but definitely still overwhelmingly female what I've hatched this year. And oh, those are the scent glands right there. So this is also a female. So far we're, look at how spicy this one is. I've noticed previously last year, some of the ones that I believe were het monsoon were definitely on the spicy side. So I'm predicting this one is het monsoon. For record purposes, I'm gonna put this one away first. The last three are Mojave Hurricanes, and I just grabbed the one that I believe didn't look the, the most crazy out of there, but still absolutely beautiful. When I cut these guys earlier, I was just surprised at how incredible the Mojave and Hurricane work together. And just surprised because I looked online and there weren't very many available, and I never knew what they looked like before and seeing them just like changed my mind on how incredible these snakes are. Another girl. I'm no longer surprised at the amount of girls that I'm producing. But this one, Mojave Hurricane. Look at that bicep curl the Hurricanes are known for right there. Stunning girl. Here goes another Mojave Hurricane, 50% possible hit monsoon. So this one, in my opinion, looks a little bit wackier than that last one we just looked at. Notice the dorsal circles that occur on top. The belly. Really beautiful. I love how Hurricane makes the Mojave patterns smaller. Mojave patterns are usually pretty big. Got those double bicep pose right there. Super cool. How about a male? I wouldn't mind a male. I have not produced a male yet with all my possible hit monsoons. It's, it's insane. And the girl streak continues. Well, we'll save, in my opinion, the best for last. Let me put this one away and we'll take a look at it. Here goes the final snake from this clutch, Mojave Cur Hurricane, 50% possible head monsoon. So again, look at this lateral portion right here near the belly, really crazy. Multiple double bi bicep poses right here. Take a look at the belly. Mojaves have pretty clean bellies anyway. But yeah, this one's absolutely stunning. Notice this one's a little bit darker than the others. Has a little bit of pattern on the head right there. Boy, I'd love this to be a male. And it is not. It's a beautiful girl that I'll be holding back and get genetically tested for Head Monsoon by Rare Genetics Inc. Hey, I hope you enjoyed the video. Stay tuned, very soon is coming my VPI Xanthic Puzzle video. And if you haven't subscribed and set that notification bell yet on this channel, please do so right now because you're not gonna wanna miss that. Have a great day, everybody. Take care and be safe.